Hey and welcome to my video, today's video and today are we going to talk about the Dr. Phil episode and it's very very exciting to do this video today to show you all now as you, as you know some of you may know who he is or may don't know who he is we're talking about Boomer the Dog here he was starred on the show is this and, a way of avoiding and uh, today I'm going to show you a clip you of him in, in other ways you're 48 you're a virgin, right? Yes. You've never been on a date. You don't have a job. You just put on a paper dog suit and walk around town, which doesn't seem to me to be a highly productive course in life. Well, I feel it makes me more of social because it's something that I engage in with people, wearing the costume outwardly, going around the city, and I kind of can get friends that way too, you know, people who interact with me as a dog. And owners, mostly dog owners really like the situation, you know, of me being a dog on the, you know, outside and yeah. stuff. How many of them have asked you to come home for dinner? <laughs> people do say, they have a thing, can I take you home? They actually say that to me many times for fun. I think they're just yeah, having don't fun. don't go. I know. <laughs> don't go. If somebody's wanting to take you home, don't go. I don't know. Yeah, I've, I'm safe. I know the yeah. safety rules, yes, so I'm good. Yeah. <laughs> what do you do for money? Well, my parents, my mom established a trust fund for me. I own my own home. I kind of have just, you know, it doesn't cost too much for me to live. Yeah. And I kind of live simply. I feel like the dog philosophy is just a simple life a little bit. Yeah. So it's, and dog food doesn't cost that much. Yeah. So I'm not doing too bad. Now you don't really think that you're part dog. I, in some way, I have to believe that I am. Okay. Because so of circumstances over the years that have shown me that I, there must be something there because it's that strong of a thing yeah. for me. So you think you could be a dog trapped in a human body? Yeah, in some way. I don't know how it is. I don't know how it happened but I do really believe that it's a possibility that maybe I was intended to be a dog somehow. I don't know. Yeah. Is it possible that you like went to a movie with your dad early on about a dog and you have warm feelings and memories of that and then you saw other dog things and they're all kind of always happy endings with a soundtrack behind them and so you just kind of get caught up in that fantasy? People have said, uh, you know, that it might be a fantasy that yeah. I have in the past. Well, it's fantasy. But... And listen, again, I, <laughs> I know. It, listen, it, it's people do this for a hobby. It's, that, that's okay. But you're missing an awful lot of life, um, which is if you make a conscious choice to do that, then so be it. Yeah, well, I feel it's a good compromise for me. I mean, it's kind of a compromise to be both a dog and a human in a way. But yeah, I've, beats I've, working, right? Well, I like to, I mean, I'm trying to put it together. See, that's the thing is I'm trying to integrate my life and get so a lot of I hope you enjoyed watching that vid. On the dog um, side and a lot of dog uh, that's, that's, Let's talk I mean, about it. I... Okay. Um, to him, it's sort of a lifestyle thing, which is understandable. He enjoys it very much and and he is being himself you know and it's not a problem and some some people uh, like to be um, close-minded about it and judgmental and because they kind of don't understand it but um, Boomer the dog of course um, enjoy this type of lifestyle he likes to be a dog and he feels he has a connection he has uh, a spirit to it and he has feelings of being a dog and and i know that um with me yeah i have have it as more of a hobby i kind of wouldn't eat dog food myself but <laughs> um but with him he, he, he likes it, um, and it, which is a cool thing. Um, but yeah, talking about lifestyle choices, 
um, and with people that that like to be judgmental about it. Um, while we talk about on uh, this this subject, with people judging, it's for example like for me, for example, oh my hobby, um, uh, furry. Someone would like come up to me and say, oh God. That's stupid, oh it's childish or something. And and I could turn around and say, well, maybe your hobby is is, you know, childish, but I'm not gonna <laughs> I'm not judging you for it. <laughs> I mean how I if you like reading newspapers and stuff, then whatever. <laughs> I'm not judging you for it, so why judge my lifestyle? <laughs> <laughs> my hobby or whatever but yeah now but with um with boomer the dog he has it as a uh, a lifestyle and i spoke to him in the past before he's a really awesome guy and he was he's pretty nice to talk to um i watched it i'm watching him on fa right now and i spoke to him in the past before he's really awesome to talk to and he really he really appreciates me watching him and and stuff. So it's really great. So I feel that um, today it feels like a big honour to like talk about him on the, the Doctor Phil show with the the actual clip I I sh I show you. So you remember so remember pe people um, if you're watching this video, don't don't judge a book by its cover. Uh, treat people as individuals and label people and I mean label jars not people you 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 see what I mean so just just be respectful here um i know i I know people can be judging but you know just ignore ignore those pe type of people and just feel good about your your, your um yourself and respect other people um well, well, that's that's all I think I have to uh, say today. Thank you very much for watching this video. I took time of a little bit of editing. I don't normally do editing stuff, so it's great. I like I like the Doctor Phil shows. Um, it's very interesting, even though I don't watch much TV myself. So yeah. Anyway, feel free to subscribe to this channel for more content, um, I've, you pretty much might enjoy it, and if it's part of your interest, then feel free to subscribe. Also, um, feel free to press like, if you like the video, of course, and also dislike if you don't like the video. The